Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about PayPal and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you cancel PayPal automatic payments? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is going to be a really quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you need to cancel your automatic payments through PayPal? Well, that's pretty easy. Oftentimes when you sign up for some sort of software or online service, they bill you monthly and maybe you used your PayPal account. So they bill into your PayPal monthly, but you want to go ahead and stop that. Whatever the case is, is a pretty easy process and it's actually handled here in the PayPal app. It's this blue and white one right here. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to go ahead and open my PayPal app now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and open up my PayPal app. This is the home screen. Now, one thing I want to let you know before you go any further is that if you've set up automatic payments to a service provider, maybe one of your vendors, or maybe some sort of online software that you use for your online company, first thing you want to do is be sure to contact them first and see if you can go ahead and cancel the service. But I personally know a lot of times when you sign up for automatic payments, sometimes you don't know where the company is or how to contact them. So this will be kind of a last resort if you need to cancel your automatic payments through PayPal. So first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to scroll through until you see the transaction that you would like to cancel for automatic payments. So for example, I use TubeBuddy and you can see it's listed as an automatic payment through PayPal. So what you want to do is just go ahead and click on the transaction. Okay. So once you do that, you're going to see more information about the service that you have automatic payments through PayPal. So you can see which credit card is billing and then also what it's for. Now, in order to go ahead and cancel this automatic payment, what you want to do is go ahead and click on report a problem down here at the bottom it has like a little warning sign next to it. Okay. So once you do that, it's going to show more information about this automatic payment that you have through PayPal. And in order to cancel this automatic payment, you want to look down here. You're going to see this button here called manage automatic payments. Go ahead and click on that button. Okay. So now it brings you to the PayPal settings screen. So this is really important guys. So first thing you want to know is that the status is active. So this vendor has actually notified PayPal that this is an automatic monthly payment. So you can go ahead and cancel this automatic payment by clicking on this blue cancel button. But before you do that, if you simply want to just change the card, if maybe they're billing onto the wrong credit card, you can do that right here. So you can see they are billing my Chase Sapphire card. If you still want to go ahead and keep the service, just changing the credit card, you can do that by clicking on this blue button. So once you do that, you can go ahead and choose from the payment methods that you have set up on PayPal. So if it's causing a problem on one of your credit cards and all you want to do is just keep the service. However, the automatic payment go to a different credit card, just choose the card. If not, and you truly want to go ahead and cancel the automatic payments through PayPal, let me go ahead and jump back here. Okay. So as you can see right here, you would just click on this blue cancel button here. Okay. So once you do that, it gives you a warning letting you know if you cancel future automatic payments to that vendor, you're going to have to set up automatic payments again through that vendor. So you would have to re-register with them or choose a payment method. Also, if you have services with them, their service is probably going to cancel. It's not going to continue if you cancel your automatic payments. But if you're okay with that and you'd still like to go ahead and cancel automatic payments on your PayPal, click on this blue cancel automatic payments to stop any future billing into your PayPal automatically. I'm not going to do that because I still use this TubeBuddy service. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to cancel your automatic payments in PayPal, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.